finally we proceed with the last part of the chapter such a relief it, it gives us when you come to know that such a humongous chapter is now on the verge of completion khushi milti andar se and with an anticipation to complete it fast we feel more happy ki jaldi khatam kar dete to finally ye ganda sa chapter khatam ho jayega you will not believe but this is said to be the most difficult chapter in mathematics it, it, it's not a joke it's the truth ye chapter fir permutation combination ye do chapter they are supposed to be the most difficult chapter and and set relation function ka jo function ka part hai na that if a person if a teacher need knows how to teach these three chapters na he is a genius now that that's the fact and if a student can understand these three chapters that student is a genius theek hai let's proceed with the last part of this chapter uh, it's odds in favor and odds against there are two simple formula main depth mein nahi ja raha hu odds in favor or odds against ka pura ek brilliant concept hai okay i'm not going into the depth of it i'm just telling you the simple formula because if i enter into the deep mode of the concept na tum log pure confused ho jaoge especially when there is no interaction you all are definitely going to be in a chaotic condition to jaane do simple sa do chote formulas deta hu aur ek shortcut deta hu wo yaad rakho bahut ho gaya uh we have two formula the first one odds in favor of event a that's odds in favor of a it is given by the formula p of a upon 1 minus p of a 1 minus p of a is a dash only na yaar that is p of a upon p of a complement just remember this formula this is odds in favor of odds against event a it is p of a dash upon 1 minus p of a dash that means it is p of a dash upon 1 minus a ka complement is a these are the two formula shortcut pehla jo sum karte hain usme batata hu shortcut kya hai formula yaad bhi nahi rahe na to bhi chalega shortcut yaad rakho that's all you have to remember so if i say that odds are in favor if they are in favor na it will be the event a upon its complement and if it's against ये जो वर्ड अगेंस्ट है ना अगर वो आया तो इट इज ए डैश दैट इज द कॉम्प्लीमेंट अपॉन द रेगुलर इवेंट दैट्स पी ऑफ ए दिस इज व्हाट यू आर गोना रिमेंबर ओके लेट्स अटैक द फर्स्ट सम एक्सरसाइज 11.6 सम नंबर 1 इफ द ऑड्स इन फेवर ऑफ ए आर 4 इज टू 5 व्हाट इज पी ऑफ ए सो आई विल आई विल स्टार्ट द सम दिस वे exercise 11.6 sum number 1 given odd is in favor of a it is given to me it is 4 upon 5 we have a formula a straight forward formula can i say the formula is odd is in favor of a it is p of a upon 1 minus p of a or p of a dash kuch bhi likh sakte ho this is the formula substitute na odds in favor of a is 4 upon 5 idhar dalo to ye ho jayega 4 upon 5 it is equals to p of a upon 1 minus p of a theek hai abhi tumhe na regular method mein pata hai kya karoge क्रॉस मल्टीप्लाई करो इस पूरे को फोर के साथ मल्टीप्लाई करो तो हो जाएगा फोर माइनस फोर पी ऑफ ए इज इक्वल टू फाइव पी ऑफ ए फिर पी ऑफ ए को एक बाजू में लेके आओ ये सब है ना बहुत ही लॉन्ग कट मेथड है आई डोंट अप्रिशिएट सिंपल शॉर्टकट में क्या है ऊपर कौन है पी ऑफ ए और इधर ऊपर कौन है फोर कनेक्ट आई विल से पी ऑफ ए का आंसर 
ये अगर ऊपर है तो इसको इसके साथ कनेक्ट करो इट विल बी फोर अपॉन द टोटल मुझे बताओ कि पूरे का टोटल ऐड करोगे तो कितना है फोर प्लस फाइव नाइन दिस इज द शॉर्टकट आई एम रिपीटिंग जो ऊपर है ऊपर वाले के साथ कनेक्ट करो तो पी ऑफ एज फोर अपॉन द टोटल टोटल इज नाइन तो ऑब्वियसली अगर ये फोर बाई नाइन है तो इसका जो कॉम्प्लीमेंट है ना इट विल बी उल्टा नीचे वाला अपॉन द टोटल फाइव अपॉन नाइन बिकॉज वी नो ना P of A plus P of A dash is one. तो यार उधर लेके जाना तो it will be one minus this answer. This was the sum number one. A very simple, sweet, straightforward sum.